Now to a big health warning about the popular energy drink, Five Hour Energy. Federal officials say it may have been a factor in at least 13 deaths over the past four years. ABC's Jim Avila has the story. It's a small bottle, just two ounces, but packs a powerful caffeine punch, equal to two cups of coffee. Having one of those days, tired, groggy. Five Hour Energy led the way in this new and growing segment of energy drinks, a stiff shot of caffeine and vitamins to jolt you awake. But now the federal government and the New York Attorney General's office are investigating claims that it can do more than that. The FDA has received reports of 13 deaths and 33 hospitalizations over the past four years, claiming five-hour energy was involved. Now, if someone was to drink multiple cans, which is uh, which is when we really see a lot of the side effects with this. You're getting up to astronomical amounts, 30, 40 cups of coffee. It is the second time in a month the FDA has confirmed it is investigating claims that energy drinks are causing fatal reactions. In October, Monster Energy, another popular drink that contains even more caffeine, was linked to five deaths. The manufacturers point out these are just claims, and there's no proven link between the drinks and the deaths. In a statement overnight, Five Hour Energy said the product is intended for busy adults. The company says its compact product contains about as much caffeine as a cup of the leading premium coffee. During an interview this September, the creator of Five Hour Energy told ABC News Nightline, when used as directed, the caffeine in his product doesn't do any harm. It's overblown when it's in small quantities. It's like this, water is good, but if you have too much, you drown. The FDA warning this morning that while there's no proven link between energy drinks and these reported deaths, you should check with your doctor before drinking them.